I just recently read this story about this Nazi. His name was Ernst Goebel. He and his men were executing children one day, but he didn't like the way his guards were grabbing kids by their hair before they shot him in the back of the head and tossed him in a mass grave. He actually ordered his men to stop grabbing the kids by their hair. And I quote, kill them in a more decent way. That story sickens me as much as the stories that meat, cheese, milk, and egg eaters love to tell. Hey, Gary, I only eat free-range freedom eggs. Hey, Gary, I only eat animals who were raised and killed humanely on a cage-free organic farm. There is no such thing as humane when it comes to meat, cheese, milk, and eggs. Humane slaughter, humane rape, humane slavery, humane holocaust do not exist. And if for some reason my aforesaid words and the video we just watched aren't proof enough of the terrorism claims that I am levying against the meat, dairy, and egg industries, and humanity itself. I don't know. Maybe the billions of dead, dismembered animal bodies could count as proof. Peace begins at the dinner table with what you put into your body on a daily basis. Good people don't talk about kindness. They practice it. They don't pray about love. They actually give it. I know you have the capability of understanding right from wrong because you all hate people who harm children. Why not despise people who harm animals? It's hypocritical. Why protect one and violate the other when neither one wants nor deserves the abuse? They just wish it would end.